Yo, what is up guys? Hope you're all having a fantastic day. So 343 has added new maps to the community collection playlist. And today we're going to go ahead and take a look at these new maps. And they also made some tweaks to the older maps that were in the collection before. So the three new maps they added are Solution, Vagabound, hopefully I said that right, and we also got Curfew. And apparently later on they will add another one which is called Nemesis. And we're going to check these out. See how they play, give my thoughts on them, rate them out of 10. Alrighty, so here we are. The first map we're checking out is Curfew. So, if it isn't obvious already, this one's like, kind of looks like um, a city from like Halo 3 ODST or something like that. And apparently it's got Virgil in this city. I think it's this one or the other one. Um, so let's kind of look and see. Apparently you can see him somewhere, <laughs> which is kind of funny. Um, but yeah, wow, look at this. Looks pretty, pretty nice. Even got a nice little skybox up there. You can see like a hospital or something. Giant building up there. Okay, so I'm on my way right now. I think this is one of the maps that was actually shown when Forge was going to be coming out. I believe this is like one of the Forge Council maps. And yeah, so it's interesting that we just now got it. Where is this guy? There we go. Oh, never mind. My aim is trash. Oh, look at that. We got Craig. Wait, is that like a spotlight of Craig? Where's that light coming from? Oh no, it's just kind of like graffiti or something, I guess. I don't know. That's funny. Man, I, it's been a minute since I've played Infinite. So I, I'm like really bad. I mean, I hop on from time to time, but... Yeah, this is probably like the most I've played Infinite currently. Okay, so I haven't been able to spot... Freaking Virgil. Man, dude, I keep, I'm getting shredded, man. What the hell? <laughs> Am I really this bad? I guess I'm really just this bad. Dude, look at the scoreboard. I've gotten zero kills and I'm <laughs> I got six deaths. <laughs> oh my goodness. Man. Whoa, what the hell? Okay, I found a little little hidden jump here. I don't know how <laughs> I just kinda like panic jumped and I got up here. What the hell? Oh shoot. Okay, let's get a commando here. Let's get a commando and pick this guy off. Nice, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Where's the arcade at? There's an arcade on this map. Let's go take a look at it. Where is it at? Oh, it's right here. Hold up, let's hope we don't die here. Man, see what I mean? These people are super freaking sweaty. Look, his teammate's gonna jump down on me. Watch. Oh, come on, man. I just wanna look at the arcade. Oh, got killed behind a wall. <laughs> <laughs> That's the infinite experience for you right there. Alright, no one's gonna stop me from coming to the arcade. Oh, here we are. So we got the arcade with some giant buttons. I guess this, this right here is kind of like, uh, what's it called? What is that? Like the hockey thing? I, I forgot what it's called, but yeah, we got the arcade here. Oh, look at this. We got, <laughs> we got like a thing where you like punch. Oh, okay. Well, I just broke it. Alrighty, so here's the next new map that was added. We got Solution, and this one I actually played in the custom browser. And man, this one definitely deserves a spot in uh, matchmaking, and I'm glad it's here. Because, man, this one just, just looks mind- it's mind-blowing. Especially the skybox, which I'm going to show you guys right now if you haven't seen it yourself. The skybox on this map, they know how to make a great skybox. Look at that. Oh my goodness, it's like an industrial place. It's really cool. What's he got down there? A skewer? So we're, we got strongholds this time. Last time we got... Oh, okay. <laughs> Last time we got Slayer. Alrighty, so let's see if we can actually win this one. Because the last game, dude, that one was extremely sweaty for whatever reason. Let's see how this one goes. Um, I don't know why games have been... Extremely sweaty for me. Maybe I've just I've just gotten worse because I have like I don't play infinite as much now Unless there's like an update or something like this or like an event or something So maybe I've just gotten worse and because like you know the game still thinks You know you're the same skill whenever you leave or whatever uh, You know that's probably that could be part of the reason why did I just fall off the map? Oh, well at least we get a look at the uh, At the bottomless pit here <laughs> Just like a giant elevator, I don't know. Got the bandit rifle. 
The bandit, I've realized, like, I actually like using it. I think it's fun to use, especially for a big team battle. But yeah, I've started to realize that it's honestly really not that good of a weapon. It's fun to use, but, like, it, it's, it's pretty bad against everything. <laughs> like, the only thing it wins against is probably, like, a, uh, I don't even know, like, a freaking... Ravenger or something or if your opponent just like really sucks <laughs> but like I feel like 80% of the time I always lose when I'm like up close with it going against like an AR a sidekick a BR or any or any sort of weapon like that so I do think they need to like either like buff it by like maybe maybe it does a bit more damage or or I was thinking they just lessen the recoil because i do think it has a bit too much recoil so i think that's the route i'd go with the uh, bandit but look, look look at this right here like wow they really know oh my goodness <laughs> i did not mean to do that i swear you know i would love if someone made like an elevator that like you can actually interact with although that would kind of probably break the flow of combat because someone could just camp in the elevator and just keep pressing it to go up and down you know but I would love to see like more interactive objects because I think that's what made Halo maps special. And we don't really see any of that anymore. Um, but I'd love to see more of that. Maybe not a working elevator because that would be broken. Or it could be like a one-time use elevator just because it like it adds a bit of uniqueness to a map. I'd like to see a creator, you know, attempt to like do something like that. Or maybe you press a button and it like launches a missile in the center or something and kills whoever's there. I don't know. Something like that would be really sweet. Alrighty, so here we are on the next new map that they added, which is Vagabound or Vugabound. I don't know. But uh, oh wow, someone already left. <laughs> we, got, we got a bot on our team. Holy smokes. Okay, so this one's more like circular is what I'm seeing here uh, yeah it feels like a giant circle this one actually feels like uh... oh shoot oh my goodness there's like three guys over there let's get out of there oh no see there's a, a party of three see what I mean I'm matching like I'm constantly matching parties it's not very enjoyable I, I'm gonna be honest it kinda sucks because obviously when you match parties it's gonna be a lot sweatier um, it's kind of annoying, but I don't know. So I'm seeing a lot of these, uh, like, TV things around. They're like these TV stands. I'm seeing a lot of those. Yeah, I think I might like this one better than the other one. I don't know. There's just something about it being, like, circular <laughs> that I really like. Um, yeah, so far I'm really liking this one. I like the layout of this one a lot more. Oh my goodness, is that Warden Eternal? Oh god, please don't haunt me again. Freaking Halo 5, man. He had to fight the, he had to fight the War Warden Eternal like seven times in the freaking campaign. That was such a drag. I don't even know how they thought that'd be a good idea. He's, ba he's back here trying to haunt me. Watch this, we're gonna throw in some shock nades. Clear out the zone. Kill him through the vent like it's Among Us. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's take a look at the Skybox. Okay, so Skybox on this one is not that impressive. I think the other one had a better Skybox. Not saying this one's bad, but... So the rocket spawns in the sewers. In like five seconds. This guy might try to steal it. And of course his buddy is there. Man, dude, this is what I mean. I keep freaking matching parties. <laughs> So I think my teammate gave up. I think my entire team gave up. Um, <laughs> yeah, I think they gave up. I don't know. They're about to win. So, Alrighty, so we're just going to check out the two previous maps. I got a few changes. I'm not going to go through the matchmaking system because it's going to take literally hours just to get this map. I'm not even going to lie. So we're just going to kind of look at it ourselves. I have played on it uh, earlier on my own. And so they made a few changes. Uh, I think the geometry, like the layout and all that is the same. Uh, but instead of uh, daytime, which I believe it was daytime before, now they made it nighttime, which is actually pretty cool. Got like a moon there, so now it's nighttime. 
and they changed one of the weapons or two of the weapons so right here it used to be a sniper now it's a skewer and where the skewer used to be is now a spanker or a rocket launcher um, and yeah that's a few little tweaks they made to the this map um, and yeah it's actually pretty cool how they did that Alrighty, so here we are on Starboard, which we've seen previously before. This is one of the older maps, like I said. Uh, and this is probably my favorite map out of all of them. But I think I'm a bit biased just because, like I said, Midship is my my most favorite map of all time. And this is literally just basically Midship, just mixed up a bit. But yeah, if you couldn't tell already, uh, it looks like the creator added a few lights. So it's there's a lot more light in certain rooms and stuff. There's a lot more lights in certain rooms and all that. Um, he also changed the stalker rifle into a, a shock rifle. So he added the shock rifle instead, which spawns over on this side. Let's go ahead and curb slide over there. Right over here. So if you remember, there used to be a stalker, stalker rifle. Now it's a shock rifle. And um, we got like this little piece right here. Um, and yeah, that's about it for this map. Alrighty, so those are all the maps for the community collection that they added, as well as a few tweaks to the older ones. Unfortunately, the other two older maps, which is called, I think, Absolution, and the other one's called Salvation, uh, those other two did not get any changes from what I've seen, which I do think is a bit unfortunate. But uh, yeah, it's great to see more maps added. I do hope we get a BTB community collection, because what I mostly play is BTB. Um, so I really do hope we get one for big team battle. So with that being said, I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching. Consider subscribing for more Halo related videos like this. And peace.